What's up everybody? This is Bubba TV24 and today I'm back in Subnautica. I have to apologize for there not being a video today because I'm recording on a, on the day that this video should be going out. I recorded about an hour of Subnautica and I got pretty far into it and guess what? None of my recordings saved. I did not get any of the video whatsoever and I didn't really make much progress. I did build the sea moth which is the little submarine I'll get out and show you this bad boy right here look at this guy look at him uh, we're gonna Welcome go to and Captain. I was looking for something very specific and you also notice that there is a timer on the top right so I got a radio transmission from the Sunbeam and the Sunbeam told me that they would be showing up in about 40 minutes or something like that yeah, it was about 25 minutes ago and so I'm just kind of waiting for them to show up. I need to go to this area here, but we also got another radio message for LifePod 19 here. I was looking for something for my little habitat. Uh, well, the problem is with the habitat is that I honestly, I kind of lost it. Um, so the stalkers are so wonderful because they have been stealing the cameras off the side of my building and now I have to go get them back uh, like this guy right here has taken my camera look at this jerk hey get that back out of here go and so we got back in our sea moth here um, I need to find the other camera, wherever the heck that thing went. Um, I've been looking for battery rechargers, um, an inner, uh, inner battery. Yeah, there's like a, a, a blueprint you can find that will let you recharge your batteries. And I need to find it because I want to recharge my batteries without having to make completely new ones. And I think that is going to be awesome but the problem is you got to find the blueprints for it and i don't know where they are i've been looking a friend of mine told me that they would be in this sort of mushroom biome at least that's i guess where they found it but i don't know what the deal is <laughs> with the batteries i don't know also if these things are broken or what let's find the um repair tool here and it looks like it's, uh, I guess they are repaired. I guess they're fine. I'd like to put them back here in their respective places. I don't know how to do that. Maybe I'd do it in Welcome here. Aboard, Captain. Uh, can I put the camera? I can't put the cameras in there. Okay. Uh, I guess maybe I have to build new cameras? The cameras are kind of dead. I wonder if I can like, if I take them and say I drop them. Eh, come here. If I can control them and move them back into the hole. Oh, found a bunch of limestone chunks. We can turn that off. Uh, what I am looking for is Rex. We'll look for that in a minute. So we can move the cameras. We're going to move them back into there. Okay. Oh, yeah, she's uh So there's a wreck over here. So this is kind of cool. We can control where they go. Oh, this is something I haven't ever actually played with. So it says that there's something here, but we haven't the problem is when I was searching through the wreckage yesterday for for an hour or however long it was, um, I found nothing but laser cutters, and that's it. That's all I found were laser cutters, and it's a little bit irritating because I don't know what that is. Uh, that is not what I'm looking for. Ooh, I'm just running into stuff because I have seen like 12 laser cutter fragments and so I'm wondering if 
what they give me in terms of the world is random. And if that's the case, I may never find a stinking thing. Anyway, so it is kind of cool. You can control the cameras. And then you can see what they see. You can go and search for wreckage, that kind of thing, like right here. Um, it looks like there's stuff all the way down there and down here. Um, so we have about 10 minutes before the sunbeam arrives. And I think it's going to be best if we uh, maybe let's have a little bit of water, right? I have some water here. Yeah. Uh, probably get a little bit of food, eat something, and then, uh, I guess, uh, head that way to where the sunbeam is, since we only have about 10 minutes left. So I'm looking to get some fish and, uh, start heading towards the sunbeam. I do want to have a little bit of food. I'm going to be fully fooded and hydrated. Whole fish. Hmm. Can't eat that. That stinks. Okay, come here, peeper. No. Ow. Gosh. Jerk. Alright, okay. So we're going to head back over here. And I think what I'm going to do next is build the laser cutter uh, after we deal with the sunbeam. Because apparently, it, the game is apparently teach it, telling me something that it wants me to do. And I guess it's to get the daggone laser cutter. I don't know. Anyway, we're going to make some food. We're going to eat the food, get a little bit of nourishment here, and then we'll head that way in about 10 minutes. Um, let's do that now. Here we go. Oops, a little bit too much. Um, can't take that yet. Okay, that's cool. All right, let's head that way, guys. Uh, I don't know how long it's going to be until we get there, but we have a little bit of time. I've got... Um, let me head it anyway. There's the icon. Why am I? I feel like I'm missing it. Ah, oh, there it is. It's really faint. Wow. I was hoping it'd be a little more pronounced, but okay. We'll head to the Sunbeam Landing Zone. It's going to be a little bit of ways, but this thing's pretty awesome. And ooh, I'd like to find those uh, energy things so that I could uh, the recharge my stuff because... That's going to be so super important later on when I have to use nothing but energy cells. So, and you know, I'm also going to have to be able to build upgrades for the sea moths for everything, really, because everything seems to run on upgrades. What's down here? I don't know if I've ever been here or not. It looks just like wreckage to me. What's this? Is this just wreckage? Can't really tell from inside, can we? What is that? Just salvage. What is that? Metal salvage again. I'm not seeing any crates or anything like that. I am going to be looking for stuff as we go because it's going to be uh, necessary to find new things. That's a door. Let's see what this is. I don't know if I've ever been here. What are you, sea glide? Um, okay, nothing, nothing, nothing. The big cargo containers hardly ever have anything in them. Uh, what are you? You're like, uh, where's my thing here? What are you? Can't scan you. So there's, geez, there's a lot of those guys just hanging out. What's down here? Anything? I'm just going to kind of explore. It does let me get my uh, air back at least. It's kind of like a mobile air station really um okay i'm not seeing anything though uh all right let's uh wait here's a crate let's see what's in here i know this is probably not the most fun thing to watch as somebody more sea glide fragments all right let's um let's go i guess i've lost it where is it Oh, uh, shoot. Here it is. So we got ourselves a little bit of speed here. It's kind of nice, really. I have this kind of speed. What in the world is that? Did you guys see that?
Oh, we're in some deep water here, guys. I saw something white, like, shining. It is deep and it is green, and I don't like that one bit. More stalkers. We're in a, like, a creep vine forest or something. I'm looking for, um... Wreckage. Let's go up here. Whoa! There's land. Look at that. There's an island. And there's a radio beacon on the thing. Oh, wow. Okay, so we found some land, guys. That's cool. Uh, good. Good. That means that there's something we can actually walk on here. Whoa, what is that? Oh, he just disappeared. Massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. Uh, whatever it was, it just disappeared, and I don't like it. Let's get to the thing. I'm looking for more wreckage. It doesn't look like anything landed here. Whoa! Oh, I just. <laughs> oh, I got really scared. I just ran into a fish. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, we got big chunks of titanium. And that's something else. So it looks like this is where we want to be for the landing site. Okay. So we're actually on land. Uh, and I'm still swimming. There we go. And I don't know what's up here. Actually, I know a little bit about the land. Um, I've heard of it. And I've seen a little bit on it. I know there's some, uh, like, little monsters on it. I don't know anything about big ones. But, um, I know these little crab spider thingies. And that's okay. We'll find them. We'll, we'll try and stay away from them. Should have probably bought a, like, a, a bulbo tree. Oh, I got something out of it. What is this? Oh, it gives me food and water. Oh, sweet. You can just smack some trees and get some food out of it. Cool. Oh, there's a building. What? Uh, so we need to be at the landing zone. Oh, there's this little spider things. Ow! You're gonna die, spider. Cave crawler. Okay, so we got a big building here. I'm losing frame rate here. It's weird. Um, nothing there. Let's see. Oh, the game is like... I'm losing frame rate really bad here for some reason. So there's a door here. What is that? Can I scan it? Oh, it can. So we can scan the purple tablet. Oh! So it disappeared. So maybe we got something out of it. Oh. I don't have a tablet. Uh. Can I make a tablet? What does the tablet make? Oh, here we go. An ion cube and diamond. I don't have either one of those. I've never seen. Oh, I need a diamond for the laser cutter also. Ooh. Hmm. I don't know where you get diamond. I guess it's real, real far down, or... Huh. It looks like there's a gate here. Can't walk into it. Huh. Well, we've got two minutes. Um, I guess let's uh, kind of do like a soft exploration here. Look around the beach a little bit and... When the um, sunbeam shows up, should be able to hop on. There's a trail up here. I don't want to get too far away from the landing site, though. Oh, there's a purple tablet here. Look at this. Huh. So weird etchings, weird runes. It's getting dark.
And there's the Aurora. That whole front part is just gone, isn't it? Well, another spider crab. All right, we got about a minute. Let's go to the to the landing site. I think we can actually sprint. Yeah, we can sprint. And we will um, we'll sit here and see what is up. So while we're sitting here waiting, I want to thank you guys for watching this series and <coughs> for subscribing to the channel, even though I've been a little bit sick in the past however long because, ugh, I got sick in December, took me out for a month, and then I got off of being sick and got a different sick. Uh, the thing is moving. Um... Uh, what's going on? Uh... That sounds like a siren. I don't like the sounds of that. Survivor, we see you. Oh. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. I don't see you. We broke an atmosphere, and we're descending towards the landing site. Where's it looking? Where's it at? Is that a building down there? What do you mean you can't identify it? Hold on. No turning back now. Positions, everyone. Touching down in 10. Oh, there it is. 9, 8. It's coming from the building? Change course. Set uh -oh. pressure to pull. Um... It's a gun. 